I'm told I don't listen to it. Some host today going on and on about their great ratings, 25 to 54. I will compare my ratings, 25 to 54, to that host on WABC right now. Furthermore, this show is growing. There's some guys in this business who are absolutely magnificent. They're mentors to me. Rush, Sean. I got buddies, too. Beck, Hewitt. And many, many more. I just can't name them all. But there's a few punks. One in particular. Keeps talking about how radio is dying. This show's not dying. We're not only on radio, AM and FM. We're on satellite radio. He's not. We have our own app, the Mark Levin app, with millions and millions of users every month. He doesn't. We have people downloading this show on their iPods 35 million times last year. Does that sound like a show that's shrinking? Talk radio, this is talk radio's heyday. This is where those who are good at this, who appreciate their audience, who prepare, who show up and are serious, not just lashing out against their fellow hosts of this industry with their feet kicked up while they're shoving food up their nose. That separates the men from the boys. The men from the boys. Think about this briefly. This is just a footnote. I'm going to move on. What would we do if Rush wasn't on the radio and this particular jealous host had his way as he trashes him all the time? What would we do if Sean wasn't on the radio? What would we do if a lot of these great hosts weren't on the radio? And a lot of great local hosts, by the way. There are many. I live in the Washington, D.C. area, about 40 miles from Washington. I listen to WMAO. There are great local hosts on WMAO. A great morning show with Brian Wilson and Larry O'Connor. A great mid-morning show with my buddy Chris Plant. Yes. And this goes on all over the country. They're great hosts that many of you may not know because they're local hosts. So there are terrific national hosts, terrific local hosts. This is bread and butter. And to have an enemy within constantly trashing the format and trashing other hosts, tune that fool out. Tool out the Manchurian hosts. That's right. This show's growing. And that's thanks to you. Because at night you can be doing a hundred other things. Listening to sports, watching sports, playing sports, going to the movies, having dinner of course. May I have dinner with many of you? Watching primetime TV, whatever you do. And yet you come here. And I want to thank you. This industry is dying for those who can't cut it. But it is a magnificent industry. For those who are vibrant, vigorous, and take this seriously as I and so many others do. And I'll continue to defend conservative talk radio while former leftists posing as conservatives keep trashing it and trashing it and trashing it. 